So I really wanted to bet against the Chicago Bears in week one. Uh, they were definitely a fade, in my opinion. The only problem was the Tennessee Titans didn't really look like a bet on team. So I decided to pass. What did I learn about the Bears in week one, though? They are who we thought they were, to quote the late Denny Green. What does that mean? Well, we're going to get into it. But before we do, I got to tell you about a promotion we have available right now at wagertalk.com. Brought to you by popular demand for a limited time. You can get all sports, all access, seven days, only 99 bucks. And that's not just with myself, but also the bad lieutenant, Ross Benjamin, the most popular personality here at Wager Talk TV. Two cappers for the price of one. No better time than right now to take advantage of that offer. As always, though, no purchase necessary. You're more than welcome to tune in and just absorb the free content. The only thing I ask from you is that you take the time to smash that like button, and that will allow me to keep on putting out these videos. Let's get into the free pick. We got the Chicago Bears getting six points on the road at Houston. The Bears picked up a win over the Titans in week one, despite scoring zero offensive touchdowns. Caleb Williams threw for just 93 yards, uh, the only on 14 of 29 passing. He only averaged 3.2 yards per attempt. Uh, the Bears offense was practically going backwards. Uh, and they were scoring touchdowns with their defense and on special teams. I heard Bears fans say, this is how we win. Yeah, well, don't get used to it because you're, you're going to have a tough time replicating that kind, of, uh, that kind of victory, especially on the road here against a Houston Texans team that put up 29 points on the road in Indianapolis. They didn't get the cover, though, and that was a result of a, a long bomb by Anthony Richardson late in the game. Uh, the Indianapolis Colts sort of snuck in the back door, got a back door cover. That game was a lot more one-sided than the two-point victory it uh, ended up being, though. The uh, the Texans had an edge in total yards, 417 to 303. Uh, first downs, 26 to 14. Houston ran the ball for 213 yards. I think this game's going to be all Texans, but rather than laying the points with Houston, I think the best bet is to fade that Bears offense. My play for Sunday Night Football is going to be on the Bears team total, under 20 and a half, minus 135. Caleb Williams, he ain't him, let me tell you. You can take that Heisman Trophy, his request for partial ownership, his painted nails. He's, he's not the guy, in my opinion. So I don't think the Bears get to 20 points. If you like this video, smash that like button, subscribe to the channel. If you got anything to say to me, even if it's nasty, even if you're a Bears fan, you hit me up in the comments below. I'll get back to you as soon as I can.